Yo, what's up guys? It is Monster Jam Collector Racing here, and I'm back with another Hobbles Monster Trucks unboxing and review video. So here's the truck. And this is from case A of 2023. So here we have Bored to Be Wild, Steer Clear, Bread Boys, which I have, the Mashing Crash Bigfoot, Land Rover Defender 90, Will Trash It All, Hobbles Monster Trucks Live version of Five Alarm, and the DreamWorks Trolls, which I have. So, which truck do you guys think this is? You guys can already tell from the title of this video, and I was super happy that I got this one. It is Bore to be Wild. This thing looks pretty neat, I must say. Very neat looking truck. It is number one of 11 of the Freestyle Wrecker series. And before we unbox Board of Be Wild, we're going to take a look at the status. And here they are. Name, Board of Be Wild, Truck Type Pickup, Strength, The Shredder, Crash Attack, Thrasher. What I find out weird is the truck type being pickup. I mean, usually the pickup trucks are mainly like these types of pickup trucks. I'm using Gutter Grawler as an example. For Border Be Wild, I think it should be a city truck. No offense or anything. But anyways, uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and unbox Bore to Be Wild. Alright guys, here it is, Bored to Be Wild. I gotta say, this is one of the really cool creative trucks. Absolutely amazing. Very neat looking truck. And here's the yellow crush car. Nothing too special about it. So, yep. Put it off the side. And here's Bore to be Wild. Very neat looking truck. And very creative too. So, here's Bore to be Wild with the orange roll cage. I really like the design on the board here. It says the Hobbles logo and it has orange stripes on top of it. It has the Hobbles Moss Trucks logo. And it's got a chrome chassis with the black rims and white B blocks. And uh, same thing for the other side. And what I find cool about this truck is that the figuring, for me, comes off. Which is pretty cool. I know some people say it's kind of molded on there, but for me, it's loose. It has holes on the bottom of his feet, so you could place him on the truck here. Oh, that looks amazing. This is probably one of my favorite trucks from this year. And the name Bored to be Wild kind of similarizes to the song Born to be Wild from the 1960s. If you guys remember that song, an old classic song. Kind of fits it, you know. So... Uh, yeah, there you guys have it. Bored to be wild. This looks absolutely amazing. So hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video.